let you know I'm still around. Do you look at this as just something that you're going to do for the next couple of years, but you, you see it almost as a stepping stone to something else? For me, or? it's an opportunity that's something absolutely amazing that many girls my age don't have. A lot of girls in the whole world would wish to be in our places and work with amazing people and amazing designers, and I feel really lucky that I'm doing this. How old are you now? I'm 16. I'm 17 next month. That's how strong my love. That's how started modeling at 14. The small town girl from Nebraska has built her success by playing contrasting roles. Look once and she's a sultry, seductive woman. Look again and she's a sweet, fresh-faced high school dropout who's doing what she planned. When I was about 9, 10, I started reading Bazaar and Vogue and I started really looking at the pictures and I started studying designers and then I used to cut out pictures and I hung them on my wall back home and ever since then I was like, I'm going to be... You know, I, I have to have something to do with the fashion business. Recently, the New York Times magazine pegged James as one of the next supermodels. Her rising popularity could earn her as much as $300,000 this year. She's really made for this. It's a really? her personality. In what way? She's kind of adventurous. <laughs> and just kind of uh, spunky. Is she tough? Yes. Mm. She, she's not, she isn't naive. She's smart enough to keep up with all of this and, and recognize what's important and what's phony. And yeah. We're very proud of her. What kind of fantasy is it for you to be living this kind of life, or does it just feel like a job most at of the first time. it was a fantasy but now it's just a job you have to be very responsible and you have to know what you're doing at all times if you don't if you're not responsible and if you don't recognize the responsibility that comes with the job then i think that you don't last as long as as the supermodels do or as the responsible responsible people do totally rude to me. I'm sort of noticed that you've got like a pierced tongue, which yeah. I think is like the coolest thing. Now what, what did you think when she came home with that? She wasn't too happy. Oh, I'm not even done with that. She was, she was not too happy. But I tried to hide it from her, but it didn't work. But at least it's discreet. I oh, mean, yeah. you know, it's not Keep like... Keep it out of her nose. <laughs>